Good day everyone. I am Brother Vic from the Little Work of Divine Providence Congregation. Welcome to Don Orione TV. I remember during our spiritual exercises, one of our spiritual director once said, and I quote, If you have thought that religious life is simpler, easier, or more comfortable life, you have made a huge mistake. And if you think that your life in the congregation will be free from difficulties, temptations, or any misunderstandings, well, you are wrong, and you are in the wrong place. It is a time for us to reflect, for a discussion, just an invitation for all of us to think whether in this religious life that we have is really for us. Now, I'm going to discuss about one of the beauty of His miracles. One of those who received His miracle is Senor Pirini Pinaka. Pirino, rather. He received two miracles from the Norione. First, when he was sent as a military, military soldier with full trust and confidence he went back home safely the second one is a tragedy for him when this uh, Senor Pierino had his uh, two more because of excessive smoke. Gabriela, the daughter of Signor Pierino, told about how was the life of his father during that time. December 31st, in the same year, the father was diagnosed because they found out that he has a cancer and the people in that village knows about what is happening and you know Mr. Pierino is one of the benefactor of our congregation he sends help during his time he sends food to the orphanage and to the people who are handicapped and people knows that he is suffering from this kind of illness and they pray over him and after 11 days or almost 10 days January 11 same year he was healed miraculously and not only Mr. Pierino received the miracle from the Norioni. You know what? I'm thinking, what makes a miracle a miracle? Maybe any of you have a very good definition what really miracle is. And the best definition for it is just a blessing. Miracle is a blessing for us every day. And we must be thankful. Because miracle is an unexplainable explainable event in our life that even scientific laws or natural laws cannot describe and to end this and I will quote from the gospel of Jesus according to Saint Matthew chapter 6 verse 25 and so on it says therefore I tell you do not be anxious about your life what you will eat or what you will drink they about your body, what you will put on. Is not life more than food? Look at the birds of the air. They neither sow nor reap nor gather into barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. God bless us all, and may the intercession of the Blessed Virgin Mary and also our founder, St. Louis Gerioni, Bless us every day with a very beautiful miracle.